of the one life drivers starting in the worst position but Opix, this is his own track and historically he's pretty decent at it so we'll see what happens green flag barvo speedway what was the time all right 50 we'll go with that oh wait that works out perfectly i glitched it first corner fairly clean so far and how the hell did he take that lead detail already up there and detail another driver that's historically pretty solid here at barvo can he take another barvo win recently the past few times from what i can recall luke's been pretty good at barvo but detail before that has quite a few wins of his own can he come back on the top spot here now and we have to remember real dill also several wins at barvo roman a lot of solid finishes and opix even though maybe not a win also pretty decent at this track so and look at this luke's still in the back but here oh no the three wide opix with a little conkage but not too bad not too bad though no no flips we're still in it and he's already back to battling with ump love to see it the elimination battle in the back between opix and ump they're gonna have their battle ump maybe trying to make a crossover happen there or something but they keep it clean loses a little bit of time opix is gonna settle into that outside cushion and oh no early on this is not looking good for ump early on Oh, look at that gap. This may be it. This may be curtains for Ump right here. And look at Detail's lead. He just had a really good start. And he is... He is cheesing out front right there. You know what I wanted to say. La, 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 la. Roman with a solid second place. And now we have... Uh, I think this has already been going on, but a pretty solid... Solid, 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 solid. A pretty nice crossover battle here for third between Real Deal and Luke. And this is interesting that they're going so hard for this battle... Because Obix and Ump are right there. The only way they're going to come back into the picture is if they keep this going. But this is a pretty solid battle. Solid, solid, solid. So they're going to keep it going. The crossovers back and forth. Neither driver wanting to give it up. Luke going to go with a little bit of a middle line with the transfer that time. And I think Real Dill that time was like, nah, fuck it. <laughs> I, th I think that time he was like, you know what? Let let's just settle in. Let's try to make something happen here. And look at that gap for detail, showing, reminding that even though it's been a while since he's been on the top spot at Barvo, he's still pretty strong at this track. Still plenty of time left, though. And now we're going to have the battle between Roman and Luke and... Roman went for the crossover there, but ends up in Luke's gas. Potentially some of the... Bynes coming into play there. Um, <laughs> it's going to lose the position. Now back to third. And Real Dill potentially going to try to take that podium spot from Roman. And let's get an update on the elimination. Look at that. Opix has stretched that gap. If he can, all, all Opix has to do is stay clean. He is looking good right now. <laughs> God. Detail, though, even though Luke has now gotten into second and is making some gains, it would have to be like another 10 minutes for him to potentially maybe make up that gap. Detail is just looking so strong in the front. And now Luke looking pretty strong in second. But we still have a third place battle here. Roman and Real Deal. And here it is, Real Deal. Going in for the pat. That was pretty nice. He's just going to take it there. Third place for Real Deal from Roman. Oh, Roman's not done yet. Oh, I, li I like the I like the strategy there from Roman and how he's trying to work this position. <laughs> I I think I like what Roman's trying to do here, and we're getting pretty close. Maybe one to go. This oh well, real details really far ahead. Uh, probably one to go right there for detail. I'd I'd have to assume. Oh, <laughs> high wall run right there. Uh, still a nice pack there, and I think Ump, you can tell. Is calling it there in the back. Is this it? No. This time, this time it's the white flag in detail. Just ran a solid, 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 solid. Dominant race here on Barvo from the start to the finish. Going to take yet another win here on the speedway. Luke with the wall run for second. 
Real Deal will hold on to third. Wow, a little conkage. Uh, Roman fourth, Opix fifth. Pretty close between those drivers. And Ump with the cheeser there. History repeats itself. Getting kicked out of the tournament on Barvo. I had to say it. Sorry. You know, you know, you guys wanted me to say it, so I said it. <laughs> and there is the race for Barvo. Now it is Ump's turn for Big Boy Jeff to conk him. Bespoken. It's time for you to go. Bye. Starting on the pole, Roman in second, Real Deal third, Luke fourth, and Detail fifth. This could be an interesting one. Watch those lights. Green flag at Kitty Hawk GP, a fan favorite here for many of these seasons. I heard those sounds, Roman. I heard that. I hear that. Off to the early start. Opix with a nice lead, and then good two way battles for the other positions. Gonna maybe single out a little bit here. Still pretty close there. Detail and Roman. Detail's trying to just get in third as fast as he can. I'd say fourth again. Not the place you want to be. And remember, how many times... I mean, Opix has started on the pole, so he's got a bit of a gap. But how many times has Opix finished fourth at this point to just barely avoid losing a life? It's so many times throughout this tourney. Can he pull it off again, or can he even have a better race than that? Maybe Roman will conk. I mean, he's in third. That's exactly where you want to be, but who knows? Oh my god. One lap down. And Opix leads that first lap, but Real Deal is close behind. Can he make something happen? I oh, gets close, lets him know he's there, but Opix still holding on. Gonna try to hold on as long as he can. And this, this pack right here, this top five, this is gonna be a good race, you can tell. This race is going to go to the end. Ooh, getting close there. A lot of contact throughout the entire pack. And yet it stays bumper to bumper from second to fifth. Opix has opened up a bit of a gap yet again. Oh my god, I'm not even going to watch the chat anymore. I can't. And here we go. Look at this. Two laps down. Opix leading yet again. So far, doing what he needs to do. Roman as well. Could it be one of the little pump drivers to finally lose a life? Oh, potentially a move there for Luke on detail, but detail holds on. And you can tell that all those drivers, third, fourth, and fifth, are getting impatient. And Opix is probably like, yeah, this is dope. Oh, but here it is. Could this be the opportunity? Real Deal has a nice run. Opix goes inside on that rumble to protect. Has a tough run through it. And Real Deal had a nice run through that rumble. A rare, good, clean run through that rumble. Does not happen often. And oh no! Not only does Real Deal take the position, but Opix conks pretty hard afterwards. And now it is Detail and Luke going to have to put on the jets. Because we are now three laps down and time is running out. Not much more futching around aloud at this point. They've got to make something happen. And that crash is so unfortunate because without that spin out, Opix is looking pretty good. But now he's in a position where he could end his tournament. Oh, Opix leaving the inside open a little bit. Detail takes advantage. Could this be it? Oh, Detail's gonna take it. Third place, late in the race for detail, and now it's Opix in that classic fourth place position. Can he hold off Luke another time here to stay in this tournament? And Opix, I mean, Roman's in second. Opix is really the only person in jeopardy here. Roman's pretty much good at this point. Everybody else is fine. He's the only one with something to lose. I mean, obviously, everyone else that has, a, has two lives has a life to lose, but, um, you know, he's got the biggest... He's got the biggest tournament life at stake here, I would say. Oh, wait till we get to Ozetta, real deal, you fucking cunt. Alright. Only a few laps remaining here.
And it looks like Rilda with a solid lead at this point. Solid, solid, solid. That's kind of, that's a fucking meme now. I gotta stop. Roman second, detail third. And look at this. Out on an island is Opix and Luke. Oh! Little contact. And I think we're coming to the white flag here. Many last lap passes in his career. Can Luke make one happen here in the elimination tournament to keep his two lives going? Oh, and Opix with a rough run, and that might be it. Side by side. Can Opix get another run back? He's going for it. Not over yet. Still bumper to bumper. Opix trying to get any little look of light he can. And that might be it. This might be it for Opix. A valiant effort through this tourney. I would say has definitely gotten farther than anybody expected him to. And a guaranteed top five. And he may end up just finishing that. Fifth place. If Luke can hold on to it here. Roman in detail. Detail is going to get by Roman there for second. And coming to the line. It is going to be real deal. Detail, Roman, Luke, and Opix. And that is it. He did not want it to be his time, but it is. We'll get to that here in just a second. So this time, Luke and Opix have both had a few of those. This time, it was Luke to hold on to that position to not lose life. What should we call that? Like, the safe thing? What should we call that? Someone come up with something. But, the good die young. Opix, it is your time. The fifth place finish, like I said, farther than anybody I think expected him to get. A valiant effort throughout the entire elimination tourney, but Opix, unfortunately... Tribe has spoken. It's time for you to go. Bye. Oh my god, what the fuck is the next clip? Alright.